Good evening to the all the aspirants of the Andhra Pradesh as well as the Telangana State JCJ Junior Civil Judge 2023 Screening Test. Karibusana in Kiswahili, welcome to my class. Please read what I posted on the screen. Transfer of Property Act 1882. What do you mean by property? Welcome to the aspirants of JCJ 2023 virtual class on 4-3-2023 case class Indian Standard Time 8.30 p.m. to 9.10 p.m. Juris defined property Simon Professor Dr. M.S. Hussain Justice Mahmood. Yes, that means you are with me and I am with you both sailing the same boat to reach to the destination. Yes, we are covered up to the 34 and in the 35th that we are supposed to make shooting this class. Section 114 of the Transfer Property Act are attracted only in the case of Dash. 1. Eshpal Lal Shiva Narayan vs. Allah Ta'ala Ta'ala Malik Waqf Azhar Khan and 2. Sabir Hussain vs. Allah Ta'ala Owner Waqf Alal Aulad 3. Bayaram Hargo Lal vs. Mahavir Prasad Murari Lal Mahajan 4. Tipaya Kupaya Vaidya vs. Rama Narayana Hegde and others. Of course, uh, options are given A 1 plus 2, B 1 plus 3, C 1 plus 4, D 2 plus 3. C one plus four. Sir. Yes, it is C one plus four is the right answer. Okay, now let us go to the thirty sixth question. Imagine a situation thirty six sir because just now we read the thirty five. Okay, thirty six. Imagine a situation where a the buyer enters into an agreement for sale with B the seller to buy B's flat. For rupees 50 lakhs. A proceeded with the agreement and paid 7 lakhs in advance to buy the flat from B. After receiving the advance from A, A took a position of B's flat with the promise to pay the remaining amount within a reasonable time. Here, A is the transferee and B is the transferor. After a reasonable period of time, the buyer A is ready to fulfill his complete performance of the contract and the gain the full rights over the flat by paying the remaining agreed amount rupees 43 lakhs. But B wants to terminate the agreement with A because he received a better offer from third party C when who conveyed his intention of buying his flat for better rate of 70 lakhs. Then B by using his right as the owner of the flat, ask the A to hand over the position of the flat. Here, the reasoning made by B may be valid one, but does not you think there is an injustice done to A? Absolutely yes. Here comes Dash of the Transfer of Property Act 1882 as a savior. Section 53B, Section 53A, C, Section 53B, D section 56C. B, 53C. B 53A part performance. It is nothing but a part performance. The whole drama. Hmm? 37th question. The TP Act, how many times the immobile property is mentioned in the entire Act? A, 0, B, 2, C, 3, D, 4. D4. D4 is the right answer. And 38 question. In the TP Act, how many times the mobile property is mentioned in the entire Act? A, 0, B, 2, C, 3, D, 4. D2. Repeat. B2. W-R-O-N-G. C3. W R O N G. D4, sir. W R O N G. 0. 
movable property it is set zero see i will show you that is a movable property four and movable property i i, I painted the movable property it is nothing but a movable property it is showing four that means movable property is zero so now of course such a question is very seldom asked but i don't want to lose any chance by any means that's my question 39th question yes how many ways or type or mode nature of the transfer of property act and the property is used as a four ways b five ways c six ways d seven ways if you give the answer i will give the 50 rupees four ways w r o n g you lost the 50 rupees it is a bit five ways a bit tough question but what are the ways if you tell me i will give the 100 rupees <laughs> option <laughs> sir show the option in option is the answer is there it is the five ways here i have shown you the tp act property used as tangible material things like land house furniture jewelry and uh, here both all of them both mobile and immobile properties tangible and rights which are exercised over the material things that is a uh, intangible in way enjoy possess to sell or to gift and the right which are not exercised over any material things like uh, repayment of a debt that is nothing but uh, actionable claims property means proprietary right in rem or in personam yes it is against the whole world or against a particular person in the contract property includes the person's legal rights whatever the description if any right would be there yes it is intangible and the property would be the four five ways it could be passed 40, 40th question under section 25 of the transfer of property act 1882 the property can be transferred complying to the condition mentioned if the condition becomes dash the transfer would be held void number 1 intolerable 2 forbidden by law Three opposed by public policy. C immoral. Option A one plus two plus three. B two plus three plus four. C one plus three plus four. D one plus two plus four. B two plus three plus four. For by for Biden by law opposed to public policy. Moral. Yes, it is not intolerable. Actually, I changed. That is impossible. In not intolerable, impossible is there. Yes, it can be used. So, forty-fourth question: The Transfer of Property Amendment Act, which year? A. Two thousand. B. Two thousand one. C. Two thousand two. D. Two thousand two thousand three. Amendment Act. Latest. C. Sir. Two thousand two. Yes, it is the two thousand two is the latest act. Okay, now the Transfer of Property Act two thousand two Act number. A one B two C three option D four D four sir wrong three three is the right answer. Now let us see this question: Where a property is transferred to R for the benefit of a woman who is not a dash, with a condition that she shall not have the power. During her marriage, to transfer or create any encumbrances in the soul of property transferred to her. Number one, Buddhist. Number two, Christians. Number three, Hindus. Number four, Muslims. Options here I have given. And A, one plus two plus three. B, two plus three plus four. C, one plus three plus four. D, one plus two plus three plus four. Feedback. C, one plus three plus four. Yes. Feedback I have already shown. C one plus three plus four. Yes, because the host added the Christians. Christians are not there. Now another question. The word gift first time appeared in the Transfer of Property Act in the 
A section 121, B chapter 7, C chapter 120, section 122, D all of the above. All of the above. Okay. Section 121, it is not there. I know I want to confuse you. That's why I wrote, I wrote Section 121, there is no word of gift. But Chapter 7, the first time appeared in the chapter Section 122, it is defined. So the right answer is? 7. Because it is Seven chapter seven appeared, not defined. Appeared. One twenty two gift defined. Yes. A gift is the transfer of certain existing mobile and immobile property made voluntarily and without consideration by one person called the donor to another called the donee and accepted by one or on behalf of the donee acceptance went to be made. Okay. B. Gift is the transfer of certain existing mobile and immobile property made voluntarily and without consideration by one person called the donor to another called the donee and accepted by on or on behalf of the donee acceptions when we made. C. Gift is the transfer of certain existing mobile or immobile property made voluntarily with consideration with consideration by one person called the donor to another person called the donee and accepted by or on behalf of the donee acceptance when he to be made. Next D. Gift is the transfer of certain existing mobile or immobile property made voluntarily and without consideration by one person called the donor and the other called the donee and accepted by the accepted by or on behalf of the donee acceptance when to be made. So there are A, B, C, D, which was the correct answer. The correct answer is B, sir. C. C is the correct answer. Because in A, certain existing mobile and immobile That's and is inserted in the place of R. R is there, but uh, I wrote and. Sir, C is not correct, no, sir, because uh, gift is without consideration, but there you mentioned as with consideration. See, let me check. Yeah, 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 yeah. You are right, you are right. Mm -hmm. B is the correct answer, not C. Yes, sir. B is the correct answer. Yes, you are right. Because here in the C, what I did it, you no? Know, voluntarily without you the consideration. He changed it into with consideration. And D changed from another to other by the host. So the right answer is B is the correct answer. Is it clear? Yes. So B is the correct answer. That is the answer. Okay. Now let us go to the next. 46th question. How many times Indian Registration Act 1998 is mentioned in the TOPA? A. 7 times. B. 8 times. C. 9 times. D. 10 times. Indian Registration Act. How many times? A, A, seven times. Answer is seven times. You are right. And 47th question. Indian Contract Act 1872. How many times mentioned in the TOPA? A, zero. B, one. C, two. D, three. B1. Are you sure? Yes, sir. Not. Two times. It is seven times Indian Registration Act 
and the Indian Contract Act only two times. Uh, so now, how many sections are repealed in the TOPA? A, 10, B, 11, C, 12, D, 13. B, 11. The answer is 13. The answer is 13 is the right answer. And 49th question, match the mismatch the following. Of course, 53A, everybody knows. Part performance, 59A and 50, 60 capital A, 60 capital B. 60 capital A is right to inspection and the production of document. 60 capital B is obligation to transfer to third party instead of retransfer to motor gauge. And 59 capital A is reference to motor gauge and motor gauge to include the persons deriving title from them. I say mismatch. Options are given here. A, 1 plus 2, B, 1 plus 3, C, 2 plus 3, D, 3 plus 4. D3 plus 4. D3 plus 4 is a mismatch. Because 60 capital A is the obligation to transfer the third party instead of the re-transfer to the motor gauger. 60 capital B is right to inspection and the production of the document. Other two, I did not change it. 53 capital A, everybody knows it. Part performance. And supplementary question. In which section Lot of cases are appeared in the Supreme Court of India. Supplementary question. 53A, sir. 53A. 53A is the many cases appeared in the Supreme Court of India. Now 50 match the following section part A and the explanation given in part B. Now, part A, 65 capital A, 2, 67 capital A, 3, 69 capital A, 4, 114 capital A, part B. Mortgage when A, mortgage when bound to bring one suit on several mortgages, B, mortgages power to lease, C, relief against the forfeiture in certain other cases, D, appointment of receiver, options. A, 1B, 2C, 3D, 4A, B, 1C, 2A, 3D, 4B, C, 1B, 2A, 3D, 4C, D, 1D, 2C, 3B, 4A. B, sir, 1C, 2A, 3D, 4B. W, R, O, N, G. Second option. C. C, C, C is C. the second option. C, 65 capital A is mortgages power to lease and 2, 67 capital A is mortgage when bound to bring one suit on several mortgages and 69 capital A is appointment of the receiver and 114 capital A is relief against the forfeiture in certain other cases. Is it clear? Yes. Yeah. I know. How, how many I did it? Forty-nine, fifty. No. I made some more things. I don't know. I thought I can make some more things. Six twenty-one. So we made so several times. Okay. Now, let us go to the Bear Act. How many chapters are there in the TP Act? Supplementary question. How many chapters? Twelve chapters. Seven chapters. Eight chapters. Eight chapters. Okay. Then... Any parts are there in TP Act? No, sir. Schedules are there in TP Act? No. 
But when he had written schedule, I don't know whether it is there or not. Let me pull down to see. Yes, yeah, schedule is there. So one schedule is there. Which section that schedule it is there? Consider, correct it to which section? For supplementary question. It is connected to statutes, not section, only statutes. And again, all these things are given the statutes. What are the things that are covered in the schedules? Number A, statutes. B, acts of the Governor General in Council. C, regulations. Yes. They may ask, what are the things should be covered? Even they can ask, what is the sequence? Statutes or acts or the governor of the general council or the regulations. Possibility I am showing. And uh, supplementary question. Which section is first time the main section is added? To the main section. Supplementary question. Sir, the your voice section. is breaking. Once repeat. Repeat once questions. In the amendments, first time, in which section, main section, the amendment is added? Six, section six. No. I say main section, 53 capital A. Yes. See, main section in the sense, uh, I will show you here. See, this is the actual sections. When you see the 53, the first time, it is 53A is added. This is the, to the main section. And uh, later on other amendments are there, no doubt. And I asked all the 59A I asked, 60A I asked, 60B I asked, 67A I asked, 69A I asked in mismatch or match the following. Only the last two sections I did not ask. This last were I think 69A. No, 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 not 69A. 113, something like that. Yes, 113A and 114A. 114A you asked in mismatch. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Is it? Then what I not yes. ask? Here. Here, this thing I did not ask. 130 capital A repealed and 135 capital A repealed. I can ask like that also. I can write something then I can say mismatch. Then you have to find it. 130 capital A is repealed and 135 capital A is also repealed. And I did not ask you because last time I several times I asked it earlier. I don't know whether you are watching my earlier TP Act MCQ. I dealt at least three or four times TP Act MCQ. In each time, I will try to make the new things. And this time, I did not ask the I write chapter 3, so and so, chapter 4, so and so, chapter 5, so and so, and chapter 6, so and so. Match the following. I will mismatch it. I will try to change it. Then I say, mismatch, match the following. Which chapter deals with which chapter? Like chapter 8 is given of the transfers of actionable clients. And uh, in which chapter, which section actionable clients are there? Which section deals with the actionable clients? Supplementary question. Is it 130, 131, 132, 133? 130. 130. 130. 130. When, 130. I, when I give the options, you are giving the answer. When I don't give the options, you are not giving the answer. <laughs> but certain sections should be on the tip of your tongue. 
by looking at it not without looking at it also you can do in your position to say like 53a part performance part performance so in that manner without looking into it it should be at the tip of your tongue and uh, who are the persons not entitled to make the bid in the action of the court public servants no there are given two or three not public servant public servant can act it is the employee the german state court and uh, the advocates also not entitled but can a munshi is entitled munshi munshi they say yes munshi can be but other people are not entitled for the bidding because they know how much the cost of it and what is the property also so that is the generally i asked several times in the in my earlier classes such question and the cases also there's the following cases how it could be but in cases we cannot remember unless until like a hegde case i told you karnataka case what is the karnataka case 51 i asked section, yesterday yes section 51 yes but uh, wordings i want when there is a special act is there then the tp act will be eclipsed tp act will means no more in use so special laws will cover the general laws another point a supplementary question when the no jurisdiction is given which court is having the jurisdiction to entertain such a case then which act will use it i mean court will use it court of inferior jurisdiction no. so jurisdiction is not covered by the act when the jurisdiction is not covered by the act generally we follow what jurisdiction cpc and crpc where the cause of action arises and in which place it is happened that jurisdiction territorial jurisdiction yeah that cpc jurisdiction crpc jurisdiction will come out like in the if you know other act our section will be attracted to a particular problem then what comes to the rescue special law i said no statute no act no section is applied over there then how that would be tackled no constitution no act no statute common law practice justice equity and good conscience that would be practiced that's why if no special law is there no act is there no section is there no decided cases is there in general then common law rule over there the common law will never die even if it dies also i told several times to my students in the class as well in my online class also suppose if the common law dies but it will rule from the grave i repeat it will rule from the grave that means that was powerful the common law is there so that is the supplementary questions may be asked in that manner 
two. And if you see my, watch my earlier video classes, I dealt many ways, in many point of views, in many angles. But in today class, the special angle is how many times mobile property is used and how many times immobile property can be used and how many times transfer of prop transfer is made the word transfer these are the things that we asked you this is a, a new type of the things and i also also asked the new type of it lee carborazer who is he Lee Carbozair. Yesterday I told you he is an architect and he designed yes U City. I gave the facts yesterday. Seven arteries, heart, hands, face, valve. Participants, are you there? Yes, sir. But why you are not giving answer? What is that city where the, I have given the facts and I put the Zawadi also, but uh, no, but you did not succeed. What is the name, place, the city name? Say Pasan. Pasan. How could you forget it? Chandigarh. The next plant city is. I told yesterday class. Bangalore. So the facts of the case law that I narrated, it is given the body parts totally. In that way, Chandigarh is there and the case law that I put it over there, residential society of Chandigarh versus territory, union territory of Chandigarh. That was the thing in yesterday class we discussed. I don't know how you forget that thing. Lee Carbozair. Why you should not you just you can make Chandigarh enough. See, this is the Chandigarh twenty eighth case law. A monumental architecture as enunciated by Lee Carbozer is based on the principle of the town planning concept of sun, space and verdure. Lee Carbozer incorporated the principle of light, space and greenery in the plan and used to human body as a metaphor. The head contained the capital complex, the heart being the commercial center, that is the sector 17, lungs, the leisure valley, innumerable open spaces and sector greens, the intellect, the cultural and educational institutions, the viscera, the industrial area and the arms having academic and leisure facility like open courtyards, the circulation system is conceived as having seven types of the roads known as seven valves, seven veins are the facts of which the case law is. And here I told you, Residence Welfare Association versus the Union Territory of Chandigarh is the right answer. And you have forgotten. <laughs> Lee Carbo is there. And he is the architect of the Chandigarh. I don't know whether you have been to Chandigarh. Sir, I born in Andhra Pradesh and I die in Andhra Pradesh. 
లవణ్యా సార్ నా టైం ఆంధ్రప్రదేశ్ ఐమ్ తెలంగాణ వెర్ యుర్ హెల్ప్ ఫర్ ఏపీ ఆంధ్రప్రదేశ్ ఆంధ్రప్రదేశ్ ప్లీజ్ సీ ద సిటీ చండీగఢ్ ఇస్ వెరీ ప్లాన్ సిటీ ఇన్ చండీగఢ్ ఇఫ్ యూ గో డోంట్ మిస్ టు సీ ద రోజ్ గార్డెన్ నెంబర్ వన్ నెంబర్ టూ రాక్ గార్డెన్ దెర్ ఇస్ అ రాక్ గార్డెన్ ఈజ్ మేడ్ అండ్ ఇట్ ఈస్ ఎ వెరీ మచ్ ఇంప్రెస్యూ టు సీ ద రాక్ గార్డెన్ అండ్ అనదర్ ఈజ్ స్మాల్ లేక్స్ ఆర్ దేర్ వేర్ యూ కెన్ డూ ద బోటింగ్ and the go to the city very planned city if you happen to see road all roads look alike because of the centers a big centers a good lawns and uh, flowers in all centers you find it so each center look like the same but they are different of course sectors are given and there is a arrow marks are given which sector and what is what it is clearly mentioned over there so please get the chance to see the chandigarh when you happen to go to the kullu manali where is this kullu manali karnataka <laughs> goa himachal pradesh hp when you go to the kullu manali you have to go to the goa from goa either you can go by bus and it is a very chill place especially in the cold season if you happen to go and he, there would be a ice would be there but generally even the goa also there would be ice in the a, a bit uh, peak areas not in all areas so with this i would like to stop my today's class and uh, tomorrow when you see the time table yes tomorrow is the fifth and uh, fifth uh, what is the third fifth you no know, here is a uh, here it comes fifth yeah fifth april forest laws in telangana state under the wildlife protection act 1972 i don't know whether uh, AP is also having not a, there in AP sir yes for AP is not there still going on a state and wildlife protection act but still participate it when i get सारे जहां से अच्छा हिंदुस्तान हमारा जय हिंद